Johann Kepler was an important astronomer during the Renaissance in Europe. Born in 1571 in Austria, his fascination with astronomy began at a young age when he observed a passing comet and a lunar eclipse. He went to a prestigious university and became skilled in the arts of philosophy, mathematics, and astronomy. He interwove the three into a unified science comparable to modern astronomy. After his work at the university, he studied under Tycho Brahe, who soon later died. Some say that Kepler killed him, but this is largely unsubstantiated. Regardless, he used the data he and Brahe had collected to publish the first defense of the Copernican theory of heliocentrism, the theory that the sun is the center of the solar system. He also discovered that gravity is diminished with distance and it is defined by the inverse square law, which is a governing rule throughout physics. After recording more astronomical data, he discovered more things and made even more laws, the scope of which would take me beyond the two-minute limit of this video. His crowning achievement were the Rudolphine tables, which recorded the movement of planets throughout our solar system. Although initially unable to publish it due to the ongoing Thirty Years' War, he gained the position of advisor and was finally able to do so shortly before his death. These were all part of his general working theory, that the universe was not necessarily the work of the heavens, but that it was governed by rules equally divine, mathematics.